This episode of Techno Buffalo is brought to you by the Air Force Collaboratory. What's up, everyone? Welcome back to the episode of Rettinger's Rants. I'm your host, John Rettinger. It's the show where I get mad and scream about something that has to do with technology. This week, I'm using a handheld mic because it makes me feel more professional. I'm going to answer one of the questions I get more than anything ever. This is Rettinger's Rants. Let's go ahead and get started. I read every single email that comes into the contact us form on Techno Buffalo, and I can't respond to all of them. I do spend the time to make sure I read every single one. And the one question I get more than anything on those comments and on the comments on Techno Buffalo YouTube channel on the website isn't what telephone should you get? Isn't what tablet should I buy? Isn't why is Apple better than Android or why Android's better than Apple? It isn't why Fat Man XXL is still making comments. It is what happened to John Quatch. Where did he go? Is he still with Techno Buffalo? And I'm sick of answering this question. I do it all the time. I reply to all the emails that ask this. I've got it copied right into a text document. I just paste it into the emails because I write it so often. So I figure I'm going to put the rumors to rest. I'm going to tell you what happened to John Quatch. Hi, John Quatch. Hi. Everybody wants to know what happened to you, what happened to what's the apps, where did Waffle John go, where you been at all this time? Well, I had to take a break to, you know, find myself, you know, took a couple of years, um, need to take some personal time to just explore the world within the vicinity of my home, you know, with internet and everything. I, I didn't want to deprive myself, but yes, I had to find myself. In the way of uh, not doing videos, because I just, I just didn't enjoy it anymore. What was it about videos you did not enjoy anymore? I, I mean, when I did videos, I mean, it was fun because I got to write a lot of things. And it was fun because I got to learn the video making process and editing and all that kind of stuff. But the only reason why I was on camera before was because I had to be. So you missed the process? Mm, I'm still pretty much involved in the process, or at least afterwards when I have to edit your stuff. So. What's your favorite part of the process? Oh, editing your pretty face. Oh. oh. So I think that you would have probably been one of the greatest tech YouTubers ever if you stuck with it. And people ask, like, are you still with Techno Buffalo? Did I just say you can't be in videos anymore? That couldn't be anything farther from the truth. 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 That couldn't be anything farther from the truth. I still beg you to come mm. into videos and just to, just to show up and yeah. say hi so the audience can just see you're pretty phased. So maybe tell the folks what you do for Techno Buffalo now that maybe they don't realize, you know, everything that you do uh, for the site aside from just being on video. Um, well, basically, I do a lot of the design and development work nowadays. So a lot of and the code by stuff. a lot, you mean all of it? Well, I don't want to take all the credit, but yeah, I don't, I don't know. I just do a lot of the um, design and development work nowadays. I do some of the video editing um, and I work with yourself and other TB folks to, uh, you know, get their ideas to fruition. For example, we, re we released a lot of, you know, the big pretty feature like uh, Joey's uh, Assassin's Creed posts and stuff like that. So oh, I'm, I'm behind that, I guess. John's a little humble. Um, anything on the site that looks nice, whether it has to do with the homepage or an article or formatting. It's all Roy. Uh, has is John Quatch's uh, <laughs> handiwork. Uh, John, also does, John also does all the editing uh, for all the Revision 3 videos. So he edits... Uh, Ask the Buffalo. He edits edit this one. You're gonna edit this yeah, one. Edit this you're, gonna, one. You're, gonna, you're gonna edit the hell out of this one. I will. He edits Rumor Roundup, uh, and he edits Rettinger's Rants, and he's also gonna edit an upcoming show that we haven't announced yet. Yeah. Fourth show. I don't even know what that's about. It's secret. Yeah, I know. So if you could say one thing to the audience, that I can already see the comments mm. saying how much they miss you and begging you to come back. Mm -hmm. What do you say to your legions of fans who are throwing their undergarments virtually at you right now? Oh, okay. Um, you should throw them this way. Do not throw yes, them this way. Them this, they're used. Make sure they're used. That, that's like the best one. Used okay. or like soiled? Huh? Used or soiled? Soiled is a little gross. It is a little yeah, gross. It is a little gross. But soiled, yes. Soiled's the best one. Okay. Yeah. So, what was what, the question? What, what address should I send them to? <laughs> <laughs> I don't remember. Something about what I have to say. Oh, yeah. Um, I'm still alive. Don't worry. I'm going to be here for a long time, hopefully. Um, you better and, be. Yeah, and I'm still very, very much involved with Techno Buffalo. Just no longer in the video side of things. But I mean, I did a CES video this year. I'm probably going to do another one. Popcorn. Popcorn. Yeah. If people ask enough in the comments for you mm -hmm. to show up in a video every few months, 
would that be enough to persuade you to show up in a video every few months? Possibly. I don't know. I guess you guys have to leave a lot of comments. And, so, and not just this video, all of our videos. So if people just... Not, not just all of our videos, other videos telling them to watch our videos. So if people just wrote in the comments, for example, we want John Q. And if you saw that enough, mm -hmm. we want John Q, you, mm -hmm. John Q, would show up. You'd be like a genie, like, or Beetlejuice. If we say your name enough, mm -hmm. you will appear? Sure. No one has to rub your lamp though, right? Huh? At least twice. Twice? Twice. Twice to rub your lamp? Yes. Why not three times? What happens after the second time? You don't want to. You don't want to. Gross. Yeah. We take a break from the video for just one minute to thank our friends at the Air Force Collaboratory. Visit the Air Force Collaboratory at airforce.com slash collaboratory. Work with real airmen to solve some of the Air Force's toughest science and technology challenges. Your idea could change everything. This has been a very... Uh, fun episode mm -hmm. of Rettinger's Rants, where it wasn't so ranty, but I just wanted you guys to know that John's still here, and I do read all the questions. John is still more involved in Techno Buffalo than ever, probably more than, than you would, ever. Like, more than the you would like to be. In the history of Techno Buffalo. In the history of things, John is... 15 years. John, John, John is, is, is involved in it all. Mm -hmm. So I want to let you guys know, John is still here, he's still kicking, he's still doing his thing, his thing has just changed a little bit. So until next week, when I'm back with another episode of Written Just Rants, you will know that John Quash is still here and still rocking it. Please give this video a thumbs up for, for this guy. Because look at that face. I mean, how could you not? Mm -hmm. We would definitely appreciate it. Uh, I'm John Rettinger. I'm Roy Choi. And I'll see you in the next video. Oh my God. Oh. What? Was it about videos you did not enjoy anymore? Um, well, I, I believe Mickey Mouse once said that, um, I forgot what he said. It, it, it inspired me in many ways. <laughs> I don't know what I'm talking about anymore. Uh, I'm John Rettinger. I'm Roy Choi. And I'll see you in the next video. <laughs> <laughs>